Waz with just a gentle right arm medium pacer. Pushing back into the pads of Natarajan. It's wide, Natarajan throws the hands of it and cracks it through the covers. Good length ball and it's taken the top of off stump. Nawaz comes back from the boundary. Natarajan decides to try to heave him over to the leg side. It wasn't that short. It was a good length ball and Nawaz is rewarded. Natarajan on his way back to the sheds. Have a look at the replay. Ball just a touch too full to be playing that shot. Another well, good length ball popped up. Fielder tracking back at mid off for the catch. Shahid Sawar shows a very clean pair of hands. And Balasubramanian, he's walking back to the sheds, not having troubled the scorers. And the second wicket down for the Royals. They are facing an uphill battle now. Seven for two. Oh dear, that's that's really poor. Poor all round. First of all, the shot. It was a very wide delivery. Trying to hit it hard. It offers a simple catch, which gets dropped. Sometimes you say cricket's the winner, Rico, but I'm not sure that was the case. <laughs> These balls to try and take singles or anything. I mean, that's a loose one. And that one will go all the way. So, finally, we see another boundary. Yeah. That one's a full toss. The umpires have a little look at each other. It will go to the boundary. So four runs. But uh, now he's looking to play it. And that one is, well, he's given him. It's going to be pretty close because they're pretty straight. The only thing I think the umpire's got to think about here is if there's any bat involved. And uh, there wasn't. So the finger does go up. Let's keep an eye on this. And, yeah, that's plumb. That is absolutely plumb. The first ball of an over. That one's a much better length ball, unfortunately, for the bowler. The inside edge that's flown away to the fine leg boundary. Well, it's poked through the offside. He's found the gap between backward point and forward of point, and that's a much needed boundary. City of Stockholm up in the north of Sweden. There's, that one's just cut backward of point. And the, the southern Swedes and the Danes. Bit of running between the wickets that uh, the batsman's been caught short. Uh, Tamel Savan, he's on his way back to the pavilion. <laughs> Where it's going to go to or what it's going to end up looking like. I did a couple last night, I think, and uh, there's that one that's being played nicely. That's a bit over-pitched. Fourth ball, he still hasn't troubled the score as Swain <laughs> pitches it, probably contacting just outside of stump. There was an opportunity for the wicketkeeper to run him out as well. We'll see on the replay. This is angled in... Very tough call. Could have Ooh. gone either way. But as it is, is still there. Oh, so fly the ball from Sawa. It's been popped up. Oh, the fielder tracking back from mid-wickets. Made a great effort. I think that was Swain. He's cracked his head. We'll have a look on the replay. Tracks back. Almost manages to grab Ooh. it. And the melon makes... Again, there's a leg spinner from Sawa. Got plenty of air. It's like a 9-iron popped into the green. Oh, Sassindran's run out. He turns trying to take the second. And this time he's going to take more than two steps towards the pavilion. He's on his way out. Such a disappointing dismissal from the man who had to be there to the end. 1-0 straight into the stance. Mello Boyana. Just gets it high, keeper rolls around and actually takes a really good catch. Harris injuries, he hasn't had too much to do. He's got the sleeves rolled up. He's ready to put in the work. And that's a good grab to send Melly Boyana back to the pavilion. And yet another wicket goes down for the Royals. They are now seven down and he's managed to get straight in front of fine leg. Beautiful ball from Nawaz outside of Stump and that's very much indicative of how Evergreen's bowling lineup have gone about their work today. They've been very impressive, very consistent, bowled some good channels, and that's a disappointing batting performance from the Itabori Royals after their double success yesterday. They have managed to construct an innings of only 53 runs.
Shows it again there, a little bit shorter than his typical length as he comes into Sawa, who's opening with Nawaz, who's gotten very excited about the chances of the Royals. He may be less so after Nawaz has just played a glorious shot. It's good. Varith Conker comes on to bowl. The chance here for Subash. He makes good ground coming around from long off. That's a great catch, and the skipper, Conker, he gets a wicket first ball. Much needed scalp for the Yetabori Royals. Evergreen Cricket Club, five for one. Coming in for his second delivery. Well, that one's a little bit wider of off stump and it's been thrashed for a wonderful strike over the cover boundary. That's a Maximo and not just that, but a magnificent shot for your first ball. Nice length ball from Sassindra, but he's whipped over the top. There's only the two fielders out, and that's a lovely cricket shot from Nawaz. Six? Yeah, it's been no six. We have. <laughs> so what? The, the first ball of Ali's innings. Four. Bowling. Another decent length ball, but it's been drilled over the top, and Hunt one through cover done the same thing that one's too much on middle and leg stump and it's whipped away backward of square another boundary that desperately needs a toilet with none inside as that one's flown out to cover has come in and taken a good catch another reward for conquer keeping the ball well pitched out up outside off stump and nawaz who has thrashed the ball to all corners of the ground so far he departs for 20 off 10 balls a much needed wicket for barath conquer Conker comes in, fires it in, and well, the fielders are taken out of the equation. He's gone straight through the gate, and maybe, maybe the gate has been opened for a comeback by the Royals. The skipper, Conker, putting this team on his back and carrying them with three wickets, going straight through the thrashing bat of Ali. What a wicket. In the air, has he got the legs of fielder? I think he's coming too quick, and he's six ones. And <laughs> well, spare a thought for him there. I mean, he's done really well. I mean, he's overcommitted coming in, hasn't he? And then he back paddles, back paddles. He takes the cat, which was at the moment. Couldn't lay four, thrash towards backward points, well fielded. Shot stumps, but no run out opportunity, and in fact. Could have been an option. Oh, oh, there it is might now. be at the oh, wicket keeper's end. Oh no! Oh dear! Oh dear! The keeper Nadarajan has come in, and I don't know whether he tried to backhand. One's a bit better directed. Cart through backward point, and it escapes the clutches of the fielder, who's actually been doing a pretty good job there. Well, wow, what a way to end the match! A wide, not gloved by the keeper. That is all she wrote. In this first contest today, Rico, I've got to say, it's probably not one the Royals will look back too fondly upon, but Evergreen, they've gotten their account open with a win from their first game in this European Cricket Series Lands Corona Tournament, brought to you by Fancode. They've chased down...